On this journey, we have learned so much about Jasmine and her style, but this is where it gets real. Welcome. I wanted to take you to the salon I work at. So we are at Sally Hirschberger in Los Angeles. What do you think of this place? It's amazing. Right? Jasmine told me the only time she gets her hair done at a real salon is when she has a garage sale to raise enough money to pay for it. Well, Sally Hirschberger's got you covered today, doll. What we want to do today is help you express yourself to the highest level with the best tools, the best stylists. Hi. Hi, Ooh. Paul and Holland. Look who's here. Hi, Paul. Hi, Holland. Nice Hi. to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yay. So this is actually your hairstylist and your colorist. That's right. This is your team, so I'm going to leave you to it, and I'll check in with you later, OK? All right. Do Thank your thing, girl. Thank you so much. I cannot wait to see what they have in store for you. We've been working together for years and they are fantastic. Yes. So we're gonna make you look really glamorous and we're gonna teach you some stuff to do things, um, to do it yourself. And we know that you do your own color, right? Well, enter Miss Holland. So let's talk about your color a little bit. I do crazy colors. I do yeah. rainbow, I do, I dyed it red, I dyed it. So you're mostly. cool with that. You're cool with that funky sort of pink, purple tips. We're gonna lighten some of your ends and we'll put some fun little wispy feather, you know, colors on them, some pinks, some purples, where you can wear it down and you can be professional, but you can also funk it up with like your makeup and your hair and your new haircut. Does that sound good? It sounds awesome. Okay, perfect. <laughs> All right, so you ready? I'm ready. Okay. Sorry, so excited. I'm like, <laughs> A rainbow right now. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna start by doing like a cream lightener. Because if we put pink on top of this, you're not gonna see it. So where do you get all these inspirations for dyeing your hair different colors and stuff? The Little Mermaid was the reason why I dyed my hair red. Really? I want it to be her. <laughs> yeah. To get bright pinks and purples, you have to bleach the hair first, rinse, and then layer the bright color right over it. I'm Missy. I'm from Jellish. I'm here to take care of your nails today. You're, you're from Jellish? I'm from Jellish. Wow. Jasmine better get used to this. There are going to be surprises around every corner. Do you wear a gel manicure very often? No, only once. <laughs> Just once? For a graduation. Did you love it? Yeah, it, it wouldn't chip off or anything. It was just awesome. I want to prep your nails first. We're going to remove what you have here. Push back your cuticles, just remove the shine from your nails. Looks to me like you like purple. Yeah. Maybe a little bit of iridescent, some glitter thrown up in there. We decided to keep the nails a bit more tame to balance Jasmine's transformation. Hello. Hi there. It's time for some multitasking, just like the celebs do it. Holland is gonna finish your color while you're getting your nails done. Put me on the list of people that are jealous of you right now. <laughs> I'm gonna leave you girls to it. I cannot wait to see all this fun color. So you're all set. What do you think of your jellish manicure? Oh my gosh, it's awesome. I tried doing like a blue type of purple thing that'll make it look like the night sky, the stars, and... And now you kind of got it. I kind of got it. <laughs> I, yeah. I hope you really, really enjoy your princess day. Thank you. Have a great summer. Check Hi, beautiful in. one. Wow. <laughs> How you feeling? My face hurts from smiling. Your face hurts from smiling? That's a good thing. This is for you, and it's for you to look in the mirror and feel confident and feel like you can walk in the world with a brave face and take everything that's coming, because it's all good. It's all goodness. People are completely defined by how they respond to things, and you, I feel like, have responded so well, and you're just, you just keep going forward. 
Yeah. Remember I told you that you're stronger than you think? That's, that's totally you. That's when that girl that's all inside of you. You know, and that never goes away. Never, ever. So just remember that. I think you're almost done. They're just gonna finish your color and then we'll see what happens next. Yeah. <laughs> all right, we'll be back. Bye. All right, and so this is where your journey keeps going on and my journey ends. It was so great meeting you. Have a great haircut. From what I understand, you reference a lot of things that are reminiscent of the 40s, 50s, and so I feel like we're gonna kind of keep with that same style. I hope you agree that's a good idea. That would be awesome. <laughs> now, pretty much keep it the same length so that you can grow it out. I hear you donate your hair every once in a while. So let's keep a good shape so that when you grow it out, you can still kind of manage your hair when it gets super long. Does that sound good? All right. Hello. What do you think if we take you back to Blushington and go see our girlfriend, Emma, and maybe do something a little more punchy and glamorous? Okay. Everything is going to plan. I am so excited to grant Jasmine her one true wish right now. Hi. Uh, you huh? look familiar. Oh. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Jasmine. Welcome. Do you need to sit down? Come here. Come here, give me a hug first. It's nice to meet you. You're so cute in real life. Oh my gosh. Hi. We have a lot of stuff that we're going to be doing. So you should sit down before you... <laughs> we're going to take you from uh, daytime on the go to evening glam. Yeah? Okay. I think we want to see it happen. Yes. Let's get started. Yes. Let's do it. <laughs> She is here. I know. <laughs> you didn't expect that, did you? No. Have you wanted to meet her for a very long uh, time? Yes. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go in with concealer. <laughs> and just taking it around the nose area, through the length of the nose and then along the forehead. So with the concealer, it's always best to kind of make a little fan shape at the top of the forehead. And this is going to help to highlight She's okay. looking, oh, oh contour. Goodness. So Theodore was filling me in. I didn't know that you actually filmed your own makeup tutorial oh my on God, your iPhone, yes. but you haven't uploaded it yet. So do you have your phone on you so we can like see the video that you filmed? Do we get to see it? Oh my gosh, okay. I think Michelle and I are gonna check this out. I think we're gonna even help you upload it. Yeah, we're gonna help one. you upload it on your own so YouTube channel. All right, we'll leave you guys. You guys look like you're busy. Okay. So. Jasmine is the little guru in training. I have no doubt all of her dreams are going to come true. Do that with your, t your teeth, with your tongue. And then I'm going to just put a Q-tip on the bottom of your lip. Just close your lips gently. Close. And then roll back and forth. And this takes off the inner residue that's inside the lips that would have normally got on the teeth. And you're finished. Done. Whoa! Oh, my goodness. Who are you? You're not Jasmine. I'm Jasmine. Jasmine 2.0. Yes. I love it. Excited? Hi. <laughs> well, it's been a pleasure making you up, Jasmine, okay? So can I have a, one quick hug? She looks beautiful. Are you ready for your next adventure? Yeah! <laughs> 
Paul is at Sally Hershberger waiting to finish your hair. Do you mind if I come with you? <laughs> yeah? All right, let's go. Let's do Bye, it. Bye, guys. Her makeup looks amazing, but we aren't done yet. Time to finish her transformation. Jasmine is about to become Simply Bella.